Hello and welcome back to some more Critic Captain 2020 and part 23 of the Road to World Number 1 with England. If you are enjoying this series so far, then make sure you hit that like button down below, get involved down in the comments, let me know what you think of uh, the series, the match, the squad selection, the, the engagement on this series is fantastic. Uh, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already for weekly Critic Captain content on a Tuesday, Thursday and Saturday. So, today um, we're taking on India in the third test match. Last time out, a very, very good performance uh, overall. Apart from our openers, uh, if we have a little look at the series so far, Zach Crawley averaging three, <laughs> three and a half and uh, Rory Burns averaging 15, which is, is not very good. Uh, I don't know how much of an injury this guy has. He's still two weeks uh, away from from being fit, which I think is a bit of a a bit of a problem, really. So it's back to the drawing board. I don't think I think I'm going to drop both of them actually, Burns and Crawley. They're going. We're getting two brand new openers for this match, but who are we going to go for? That's the question. That is the question. So, I think we want to look for the number of runs. Rory Burns has apparently had a lot of runs this season so far. Doesn't seem like it, does it? Adam Lythe, New Yorkshire. What's his form like? It's pretty good, to be fair. Go on, we'll give you a go. We'll give you a go. And who else? Do I, I, don't, I don't want to go to Keaton Jennings. I don't think we've uh, we've we've slumped that low yet. Ben Duckett is always one that I want to to get into me squads. I do like Ben Duckett, and I'm gonna give him a go. He's gonna get a go in this uh, in this test match. So uh, Joe Root, Root needs a bit of batting practice. We'll give Roy some as well. Lithe and uh, Duckett. Uh, sorry, uh, there we go. And Pope. And then uh, Broad needs some bowling practice. Uh, who else? Maybe Jack Leach. I think we'll bring in Jack Leach instead of Bess in this match. We'll give Archer some more, um, some more bowling practice. That looks good. And Jason Roy, some physio as well. Right, let's continue on then. Into the match, so uh, Duckett is going to bat at two. I think we'll, we'll put Lithe in at one, uh, Jason Roy at three, Root at four, Stokes at five, um, Page at six, Pope at seven, uh, and then it's a decision. I, I, I think we, I think we bring Leach in. Uh, we're going to have Archer as our second bowler, and uh, Anderson as our first. I think that that looks like a a decent a decent squad to me. Um, yeah, I'm happy with that. Right, let's go for it then. Into the match we go. Look at the conditions. It's going to be raining early on, uh, so probably don't want to be batting. Uh, so yeah, heads is the call, and we're batting first. So not much of a choice there, but hey ho. So here we go then. Into the test match. We go medium, lithe and uh, duck it. Let's see how they get on. Over appeals, not out. The umpire didn't even bother to shake his head. We didn't know where that was. It's a big shout. That's out. That's out. Duck it gone. So his first chance to impress is over. Lithe managing to. Survive the opening overs. Oh, that was close. Yeah, lovely shot. Four runs. A bat like a rocket. Four. First boundary of the innings. And another. Great shot. So lunch interval day one then. A 38 for one. <laughs> Not exactly the most runs scored in the session, but we did lose 45 minutes to rain. Well, he's really picked that one out. That's it, the pads. That's out. Well, Lithe's gone for 25. If I wanted 25, I would have just picked Burns. <laughs> Soundly beaten, but is it out? The bowler grimaces, the batsman grins. Not out. 
big shout. Not struggling for runs here on day one. Oak off the back foot. So T interval day one then 63 for two. Jason Roy 26 not out at the moment. And that's four. Four yeah, runs. Great shot. Really gave that one the treatment. Got him. Oh, good ball. What a ball. Roy gone for 29. Unbelievable. Oh dear, that was sloppy. That's four buys. Very sloppy from India there. Shot. And Stokes gets his first boundary. Always a good, good sign. That's a confident shout. Oh, well outside. No, he's leg. still there. Just. Four runs. What a good ball. He had to play. That was a very nervous looking shot. One more run added to the total. And there's 50 for Joe Root. Excellent from him, but as we always say, he needs to convert it into a ton, really. is good from Ben Stokes I think for the last 10 overs try and attack a little bit here he's tying up for lost time he's beaten by that it was great. a ball great shot from Root an excellent off drive and another there. Good stuff. That's very, oh, very close indeed. Stokes has gone. Well, what a shame. He's out for 37. Maybe not go for our proactive end to the evening. Jim Page, hopefully he can what survive. Obviously got his sentry. First test sentry in the last... More runs here, I think. Match. Four runs. Don't bother running. Hopefully he's... What a fine get shot. Another sentry today. That's another four buys. Wow. End of day one then, 190 for four. 81 on not out for Joe Root. Certainly a good start. Needs to keep that going. He's timed that perfectly. Four runs all the way. We'd like to score 400 really here. Oh, there could be trouble here. Need to get there. Is that a run out? The umpire says not, not quite. Out. Very lucky India to hit the new ball. Straight away have Joe Root under pressure. Four. And there's four for Joe Root and he has converted his score. An excellent sentry. For the captain. All around that. Not. I'm going to try and start forcing the issue a little bit here. Superb batting conditions. And it's. And that's. Oh, a Root's gone. What a shame. He's gone for 115. So now Ollie Pope comes to the crease. The man that needs a score. He just helped it to the boundary for four. Definitely needs a score. Oh dear, what a oh, another four buys. Very interesting. Lunch interval on day two, then two sixty-eight for five. We'll certainly take that. Textbook drive off the back foot. And although we want to score four hundred, we'll certainly take. 320, 330. Something to work with. 300 is up. Missed it, oh, but it would have been a brilliant catch. 
They'll have to be quick. Ooh. Ooh, they did it. just well, make it. But 50 for Jim Page. Excellent from him. He felt for that one. This third test match 50. It was a poor ball, but he still had to put it away. That could be out. Well, he waited for the decision. Here's Pope gone. He's out for 40. He's bowled him all over the place. Stu Brawl gone as well. He was nowhere near the... Fielder had no chance. Tell you what, Joffre Archer can bat. He really can. Bold him. What? Well, not there. Well. Oh, what a catch. What a catch. Oh, it was a no ball, though. It was a no ball. Well. It was a fabulous catch as well. You'd be so annoyed as the fielder that you've done all that hard work to catch that and uh, find out it was a no ball. Four more and 350 no up. Jim Page towards his second test match century. Oh, that was close. Four runs all the way. And remember, it was 106 not out in the last test match, so he's currently on... Uh, well, we'll see what his score is in a second. Well, he's currently on uh, 182 not out. <laughs> Straight through the field. Four runs. Shot. Timing was the key there. They're appealing. Well, that must have been close, but the umpire says not out. Well hit. Four. He's just waited and picked his spot. Looks like four he is going to go towards the centre. He's on 92 now. He's miscued that one. <laughs> Edged, but four. And that's high, wide, and four runs. What an innings. He's edged it. Oh, he edges it again. It's getting nervy out there. Found the edge. Another edge, but this time for and it's his sentry. He's ridden his luck. Brilliant from Jim Page. And Jack Leach is supporting very well, just like Archer did in the last innings. Uh, in the last match, sorry. Beautiful four. shot. Four. So we've got 40 minutes left of the day. This could be out. A huge oh, shout goes that's up. That's out. Great ball. Leach gone for 31. End of day two. 4 2 2 for nine. I'd like to, to see He's Page go and get a few more runs now. Let's see if he can attack. Excellent shot. Oh, that's a good shot. Big appeal. Nope. Well, the bowler's muttering under his breath, but he'd better keep that to himself. The four. It's of my opinion, we might as well keep batting until they bowl us out. He's edged it. Anderson getting a few streaky runs as well. It's all going to help. Cool. But there you go, Anderson gone. 4-5-3 all out, but uh, Jim Page, wow, what a player we've stumbled across here. 126 not out, uh, obviously had not out in the last innings as well. Um, Average at 118 for, for, for us at the moment. So 4-5-3 all out, I think we can settle for that and uh, hopefully our bowlers once again will put in a shift and... Uh, and ball the Indians out fairly low. Anderson to Sharma. That's a terrific ball. And wow, I thought that was going to be out. I really did think that was going to be out. But was just missing the leg stump. So great decision from the umpire. Archer to Rahul. Gone. The batsman looks dumbfounded. Good catch from Jim Page. 
Archer gets the wicket. And uh, hopefully he'll play as well as he did last time. Broad and Leach. Uh, Leach needs a performance today. I've trusted him over Bess. Anderson comes in, changing the ball out. Works and Sharma gone for 66. Stokes into Coley. Great and he's gone as well. Great catch from Ben Stokes. Coley's poor series continues. Which is good news for us. Bad news for India though. Stokes into Vahari. He's out as well. He's gone for 37. Good stuff. Archer into Ayer. Good ball, but a poor shot. Not quite. Anderson in Aya. T interval day three then. 176 for four. Still lead by 277 here. Archer to Pujara. That's out. Great ball. Archer gets his first wicket. Second wicket, sorry. Anderson in there. Agaval. Archer in Aya. Gone. Caught and ball. Third wicket for Joffre Archer, who has been terrific in this match so far. Anderson gets Bumrah as well. He's gone for two. India all of a sudden needs 62 to avoid the follow-on here. He's miscued that one. They may well get it. Higaval, that's a terrific ball. And he's gone for 15. 31 to avoid the follow-on now. He had no idea what to do with that. Stokes into Sharmi. Not quite. Broad into oh. Steven. That's out. He's gone for a duck. And Stokes into Sharmi. And that's gone. So India 2-2-9 two, two, all out. Stokes with his uh, third wicket of the innings. And uh, it's a... Uh, it's an interesting one. Do we make them follow on? I think we do. I think we do. I think we get Anderson and Archer out there. Mainly because it's near the end of the day. We get a couple of wickets. And we're massively on top here. Not quite. End of day three then. 31 without loss. They survive. But we are in such a good position now. Archer Great in the ball, role. but the batsman survives. Only two days left in this match, so... Gonna have to try and get these that wickets quickly. Otherwise India could very easily turn the tables on us here. Stokes into Rahul. That's a thick edge. Not quite. Need to make this breakthrough in quickly. Lunch interval day four. 109 without loss. Leach bowls the first over after lunch. He hasn't got hold of that. Anderson to Rahul now. This That's out. What a terrific delivery. Rahul gone for 61. You can always rely on Jimmy Anderson to produce the goods. Leach into Sharma now. That's He's gone as well. Sharma out for 57. Two new batsmen at the crease. One of them is Corley. Remember, Coley hasn't had the best of time. Stokes in. Away at thin air. Not quite. So, T interval day four then. 2 or 4 for 2. We lead by 20 runs here. Brought in to Coley. This has to be close. Well, the batsman's always going to get the benefit of the doubt. Not quite, and Coley's gone and got a 50. That shows his class. New ball. Well, these two are leading India. Away ball, from danger yeah. of defeat. We're actually going to give uh, Joe Root a couple of overs. At the end of the day. End of day four. 3 4 2 for 2. India lead by 118. So it's all about where they declare now and how long we're going to have to try and beat them. Broad to Vahari. He's. Well, that was more of a great oh. stop than a drop. Uh, it's dropped. That should have been out. 
That's going to be a send. Oh no, it's a run out. Well, let's r watch that again. Coley's gone for 152. So much for bad form. And they came back for two. That was silly running. What a risky run. And there you go. But what an innings from Coley. Possibly has saved his team. He was fishing for that. From defeat. Oh, how did that make? Bring Anderson back with Ben Stokes. The big shout. So the total goes past 400. Good catch. Good catch. Vahari gone for 100 then. Anderson in. Ah, yeah, he's gone as well. Third wicket for Jimmy. They lead by 210. It's going to be so close as to when they decide to declare. Leech into Pajara. Well, lunch interval day five. They haven't declared yet, though. Lunch interval. Well, this is crazy. Rain stops play. Well, there you go. And <laughs> India declare now 265. Um, yeah, I don't think we're going to be challenging that really um, I think it's just about survival to be honest it was uh, not the best ball in innings the big shout goes up what's the umpire going to say the umpire doesn't want to know so T in the vault day 5 Adam Lyth off the mark oh that was close and we got 44 overs left in this That's test match, Lyth gone though. He's out for three. So Jason Roy comes to the crease. Trademark off drive. You know we're not going to get 200 in a session. We know that. But just try and get some form into these guys. A bit of confidence. It's a cracking stroke. Four all the way. Four. Four. That's out. Well, Roy gone for 23. You know, if we know that we're not going to be beaten. Oh, that's not far away. Oh, we shouldn't be beaten anyway. And that's four. So ten overs left in this match. Let's try and go a little bit more aggressive, try and entertain the fans a little bit. He's really cracked that one. He just can't bowl there to this man. Just a shame the rain came. I think we would have given like it a crack. The boundary. Wrong length from the bowler. That's a fine drive off the back foot. If you bowl it there, he'll smack it to the boundary all day. What a thunderbolt. The batsman never saw it. Well, Root gone for 27. So Stokesy comes to the crease. Three overs to go. Beautiful stroke. Four runs. I'd love to see Ben Duckett go and get his 50 here. Ah, oh, well. What a shame. What a shame. And there you go. Match drawn then. 105 for four. We end on... Uh, chasing 250 odd but there it is match drawn Virat Kohli um, gets man of the match for his 152 Jim Page I think he's doing very very well um, at the moment doing very very well but there you go um, we've drawn the first and third test match we're still 1-0 up in the series but obviously it could still go either way a little bit of time before the test match at the Rose Bowl and the team selection is going to be very interesting so if you've enjoyed that make sure you hit that like button down below it really does help me out it means a lot to me as well subscribe to the channel for weekly Critic Captain content on a Tuesday Thursday and Saturday and I hope you guys are having a wonderful day thanks for watching 
and goodbye.